Hey everybody, Happy New Year and welcome to my easy cooking channel. Today I'm going to make some chicken parmesan and it's not going to be anything traditional, just kind of a fast easy recipe. So let's go inside and get started. Now normally chicken parmesan is breaded and has quite a bit of cheese in it and stuff, but I'm not going to do any of that. First of the year, I'm going to try to make this a lighter dish and keep it simple. So I have a can of pasta sauce here and I've already poured it in there and I'm just going to add a couple spoonfuls of sugar to it and mix that in because I like it sweeter. Now if you just like your sauce the way it comes out of the jar then you don't have to bother with this. Now I'm going to rinse off the chicken and put it in there. Okay, I've rinsed off my chicken and these are tenderloins. Um, you could use breast as well, it'd be fine. I just kind of prefer the tenders to breast myself. Um, and I'm just going to spread these out over the bottom of the casserole dish here. And we're just going to bake these in the toaster oven. Now you could season this chicken more if you wanted to, you know, with salt and pepper or any kind of seasonings you like. But I'm just keeping it simple and uh, I'm going to put Parmesan cheese on the top and that tends to be a little bit salty too so I don't know if I really need any more seasonings than this. Now I'm just going to sprinkle some Parmesan cheese on the top there and then we'll bake it in the toaster oven. I turned the oven all the way up to 450 degrees. We'll slide that on in there. And I have a quick read thermometer, so I'm just going to cook that until the internal temperature of the chicken is 165 degrees. I'll let you guys know how long it takes. It's been half an hour and I just checked the temperature of the chicken and it's 165 degrees. So it looks good. We'll pull that out of there. Smells really good. Now you could uh, cook some pasta noodles and serve that with pasta or spaghetti if you wanted to, but I have a couple hot dog buns here. I think I'm going to toast these and make a couple sandwiches out of it. This smells really good and I got my buns toasted to make a couple sandwiches here, but let's see how the chicken looks first. I'm going to take a bite of it. Hot. <laughs> Darn, it's hot. Turned out really good though. I put together a couple sandwiches here. These hot dog buns are just the right size for chicken tenders. So I put some more cheese on top of them. Put some avocado on that one. Let's have a bite of one of these guys and see how we did here. Mmm. Man, that's a pretty good sandwich. Alright, gotta let you guys go so I can eat. Thanks for watching, you guys, and I'll talk to you next time.